Some students in Martin County today dressed up as their favorite black historical figure, such as Jackie Robinson, Muhammad Ali, and even Kamala Harris. It's all part of their black history program. On your side, Abigail Velez visited the elementary school's wax museum to learn more. I am here at South Creek Elementary where they are commemorating Black History Month with having a wax museum where different historical figures in the black community are to share their parts of history. My person is W.E.B. Du Bois. I have Mary McLabathum. She was born July 10, 1875 and died May 18, 1955. Program director Candace Howard says this event is to engage students with black history in addition to inspiring them to succeed in their own futures. During this research, they were able to find that some um, African Americans were slaves and they weren't, college wasn't available for them then. And then they found out that there were a lot of um, African Americans that were able to go to college. and. Um, and these are colleges that we've researched in class and they're like, oh, I want to go there now because this person went there or that person went there. So. Nine on your side asked South Creek fourth graders why it's important to be taught black history in the classroom. I think it's important because it's telling you about all the ways that the black history people um, changed the world. Um, Cause you can learn a lot about black history man, and what pe how people change um, lives back then. In addition to their wax museum, South Creek also hosted a program this afternoon highlighting HBCUs in North Carolina, encouraging students to set their eyes on higher education. Some students researched a historical figure that had major contributions to the history of education. I learned about like how she um, made a school with a dollar and fifty cents. That he was the first black African American to earn a PhD at Harvard University. DeAndre Bell says he has a lot of options for college as a fourth grader, but for right now, he has his eyes set on. To go to probably Elizabeth City. Some of the students I spoke with at South Creek Elementary shared with me after doing this project, they now have a new inspiration in their lives. In Martin County, Abigail Velez, 9 on your side.